so lonely, broken angel. I'm so lonely. You're promoting Malaysia's hosting of the World Para Swimming Championships. Why are you denying your disabled swimmers the opportunity to prove themselves against some of the world's best swimmers? I think what matters is the Malaysian government's stance on this issue. If hosting an international event is more important than safeguarding the interests of our Palestinian brothers and sisters ah. who have been mutilated times after times again. Why, so if that is more important. That means we have lost our moral conscience really? and moral compass. So all the other countries who permit Israel to participate in international sporting events have lost their moral conscience. Malaysia is not like other countries. Ah, so we, will protect, to we will protect the UK, the US, Australia, all those other countries, you know, African countries, the other countries. When countries criticize Israel and censure them in the United Nations, one is US will veto it more than 47 times. On top of that, when we censure Israel, US and the Western world would actually punish these small countries mm -hmm. for having a stance. I mean, Donald Trump cut $200 million worth of development aid, which could save 5 million Palestinians just because the international now community didn't stand with it. Some passion, we must be fair. I'm sure that's sincere. But I wonder if you then share Prime Minister Mahathir's view of Jews. He said, I'm glad to be labelled anti-Semitic. Uh, he said this in May last year. How can I be, or he's quoted in May last year, how can I be otherwise when the Jews who so often talk of the horrors they suffered during the Holocaust show the same Nazi cruelty? My stance is I'm against the atrocities committed, especially by the Netanyahu government. It is the actions which I stand firmly against, not the race of that person, but their actions. During castlet, protective age, pillars of defense, tens of thousands of innocent Palestinians had their lives murdered, families taken away. And plenty and of countries sanctions. condemn that and take action against exactly. it. Exactly, so Malaysia must stand firm. They don't stand against the opportunity for people of all communities, countries to come together. This it is not members of the Israeli government who are committing the Paralympic tweet team as swimmers, it's young men and women, the future generation to It's talk. also it's young men with Israelis and Malaysians to meet each other on common terms in sporting competition, the state, talk to each other and share sure. their concerns. The state is the locus of our collective moral actions. While it's not the fault of all Israelis, similarly in the context of Palestine, it's not the fault of all Palestinians for the, for the aggression of some. I just wonder what though, and this goes back to what we talked about at the very start of this program, Sadiq, and that is whether uh, we have a country that is still determined by attitudes of the past. Your Prime Minister, in a book he published back in 1970, The Malay Dilemma, said the Jews are not merely hook nose, as if that was some kind of source of criticism, but understand money instinctively. High-minded condemnation of the human rights of a government is one thing, but when you fall back on stereotypes of physical appearance, he used it again in this studio when he was interviewed for Hard Talk recently, and instinct. Are you in the gutter of politics? I hope you understand where he's coming from. To me, what matters the most what are are we're going to as a country. Exactly. So where I believe me. we are going is a country which will speak up against the gruesome human rights violations, the actions and the propensity for violence. These are the things which we will oppose and we will never stand for. I think in the end what matters are the aggression and a government like Malaysia having the guts to speak up despite the fact that there might be consequences. Is that the new progressive Malaysia you want to promote? It is progressive. We stand for the rule of law. We are against human rights violations. We are against war crimes and crimes of aggression. That is the new Malaysia. I'm so lonely, broken and